Good morning, everybody. I just wanted to do a quick review of my Bose Quiet Control 30 acoustic noise canceling headphones. Um, this is what they look like out of the box. Um, I've had them for about a week now, and I just wanted to uh, give my opinion of them. Uh, inside the box is a case and a charging cable uh, and a few extra um, things for your ears. So, my, and I'm, I'm not going to make this long, but my, my quick review here is that, you know, they fit around your neck, and of course, they go in your ear, like this. And they, they stay in your ear pretty well, I mean, like, I can, I hear myself talk right now, but it sounds like I'm inside of a, uh, you know, some kind of a, a noise chamber, like I'm getting a hearing test. That's basically what it sounds like. So it's blocking out everything pretty well. You, the, the power button is um, right down here to the inside. You push it, and there's noise canceling um, controls are here, so you can increase or decrease the noise canceling with that um, little toggle button. And then there's an iPhone app um, that comes that you can download that gives you a little uh, wheel to increase or decrease the noise canceling uh, portion of the the headphones and they work pretty well I mean I work in a, an IT shop so uh, sometimes you need to have some quiet while you're working um, they definitely are not as um, good at canceling noise as the over-the-ear headphones I think they're the 35s the quiet control uh, or the QC 35s um, but they're good enough um, and very good noise or very good sound quality of course is Bose so there's no question there but my my main purpose of getting these or my wife got them for me was that I wanted to exercise with them and I have not had a chance to run with them or get on an elliptical but I've been wearing them for a week and a half just so I can get the feel of them and the one big critique I have is you know at least the first couple of days you feel them back there and they kind of press on the back of your neck a little bit so if you've got a sensitive neck or if you've got sensitive skin um, you're gonna have a little discomfort before you get used to them once you get used to them they're fine the biggest problem I have is that they move around so within a few minutes I mean it's not even you don't even have to be moving a lot but like if I get out and go walk, walk to the building or if I'm sitting at my desk, not really moving around, but as you turn your neck, they uh, they work around your neck. I don't know why one side goes versus the other, but it seems to always be uh, one side or the other. And within a few minutes, they almost always go uh, crooked like this. Which, you know, if you're in a meeting or if you're, you're walking around the building, everybody's wondering why you've got this giant thing in front of your neck. So for a two or $300 item, I would have thought that Bose would have done a little bit more testing to figure out how to stop that from happening. I don't I don't really know how it happens or why it does. Maybe it's because this is a slightly heavier on this side, or maybe the battery is not balanced perfectly inside. I have no idea. If there's a Bose representative, feel free to reply to this video and let me know what I'm doing wrong. Now, if I when I do wear it in like a, a nice collared shirt and I put it uh, on the outside of my clothes under the collar, it stays put a little bit better um, but for the most part that's a that's annoying and uh, there's also no place to put these right so they don't they don't there's no magnet or anything like that so they don't retract so they just dangle down and I I don't like I said I worked in an IT shop so it's not like I'm going to be banging them on any equipment but if you're not sitting in an office um, there's a good chance that you're gonna destroy these or they're gonna get hung on something and that's a, a significant concern for the amount of money you pay for them so I would definitely get the warranty um, if you're concerned about that um, but I, I can't take them back and the reason why I can't take them back is because I need these to exercise I would I wanted the noise canceling um, feature for work and because I wanted good sound quality but um, you can't work out with the over the ear ones um, because the headpiece, the, the piece that goes against your skin, is not washable. You can't remove it. You can't replace it. So this is about the best you can get if you if you prefer bows and you're looking for something to work out and you want something with noise canceling um, or quiet control features. Um, so that's that's my review. I would say I give it a 
six out of ten stars if there's going to be a rating never rated products before there's there's nothing relative to go against that but um not 100 percent satisfied because of how much this twists around on my neck and i can assume once i get in uh to a elliptical machine or a, a stationary bike or if i start running that's going to happen even more because my neck's going to be sweaty so it's going to come around and i did notice that once when i've got these in and it starts twisting around it starts tugging on my ear a little bit so those are some things to consider when you're looking at buying these if you buy them from best buy i guess you can take them back after a couple days i would say i mean if you have a bigger neck maybe you don't have no problem with it but my neck's only about 16 inches uh, around um, and these just do not stay put all right have a good day thanks for uh thanks for listening i've got several other videos i have not done a video in a long time but um please click like and subscribe if uh if you enjoyed this video talk to you later